Activision, Infinity Ward, Treyarch, Sledgehammer Games, Rockstar, Sony, and everyone slash company that is watching this video, the following applies to you. Copyright disclaimer under section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976 allows to make for fair use for purposes of criticism, comment, news reporting, teaching, scholarship, and research. Fair use is a use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringed. Now profit, educational, and personal use tips the balance in favor of fair use. Yo, what is going on guys? It is X Super Lobbies here. And today guys, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to, um, change your region code on your game um from bless to bless or bless to bless anything you guys want to do why would you guys want to do this simply because some games have better mods for certain region codes um, because sometimes offsets change or maps can't be downloaded anything like that so i'm going to teach you guys how to do this in this video today so let's get started so crucial number one thing is that you guys want to make sure that the game is downloaded through multi-man anything get it on your computer you can do this, do this through filezilla i'm going to be doing it with a hard copy so there's no lag or no issues personally i would recommend a filezilla but for the sake of the tutorial i'm going to be using a hard copy right onto my computer so let's start it off down in the description below i'll have everything you guys need you guys really need the ps3 disc SFS B edit, download that, hex editor, SFO editor, FileZilla, and I'm gonna have this DLL. So let's do that right now. Alright, so let's go to computer, local disk, uh, go to Windows, and drag this into this Windows folder. Make sure it's like actually in Windows, so drag it down here. And if you have one, move it and replace it. If you don't, let it go. I'm moving to replace mine. Show you guys I'm putting it in there. Make sure that's in your Windows folder. Why? It's because this program sometimes won't run without that DLL on your hard drive. So just make sure that's installed. So let's open up our game. I'm going to be using Modern Warfare 3. I'm going to be converting mine to Bless. So you guys are going to copy and paste these files onto your desktop. So the ps3 underscore disk copy that go to ps3 game go to param.sfo copy that paste that on your desktop and get this lic dot dot put that on your desktop so we're gonna have three files right here those are the three files we're gonna be working with you guys can go ahead and minimize this so first things first go open up your web browser and Search the bless code you guys are going to change yours to. This is the MW3 one that I'm going to be changing mine to. But this works for other games like you can just type anything in like Block Ops 2. And then there's like the US31 and like you can do like Block Ops 2 bless code. And like you can find them. Like you just have to do a simple search like right there. That's another bless code. That's the Euro version I believe. But you'll find them if you just look for them. I'm trying to tell you, like, Block Ops 2, Bless Code, like, look at that, like, that Australia, like, dude. It's that zero, this is the foreign one. Block Ops 2, like, right there, like, Bless, like, that's, that's the UK one, so, that one for BO2. Just look it up online and you guys will get what you need, so. I'm gonna go ahead and copy this one, this is the MW3 one. Open up your SFO editor. Drag on in your param.sfo. Go up here, highlight that, paste your new one in there, make sure there's no spaces or hyphens in between there, and then go ahead and save it. You guys can just override that, save it. Refresh it, make sure everything is there. So, yeah, we're good on that. You guys can exit out of that. And now, open up this. Go to browse. Put in this folder. Here. PS3 underscore disk dot SFO. 
B, open that right here. Paste your code in there. Put a hyphen between the two. Like that. Zero, one, four, two, eight. And I think I made a mistake somewhere. So if I open up my SFO editor again, you guys might want to double check this too. I knew something was funky. Uh, drag your SFO in there. And there should be a simple change somewhere. It looks like. Let's see. Yeah, zero, one, four, two, eight. So there should be an eight at the end of it. So double check that. They should got the right code in there. Or it's not going to work right. So save that, overwrite it, and we're going to make sure everything matches up first before we continue. So if we open this, we're double checking things here, there we go. Make sure there's a dash on this program only, not the SFO editor, only this one, okay? Save it, we're all good to go on there. So these two files have been modified. Go ahead and open up HXD editor. But first, before you guys open up any files, uh, you guys are going to make sure you have your bless code copied with no dashes or no spaces in it. Make sure you guys have it copied. Control C, copy. Make sure it's copied because the next program we're using, we cannot backspace or it, or it will corrupt the whole entire file. So make sure you guys have it copied before we start this process. So go ahead, open up hex editor drag in the license.dat hit control F and type in the current game region you're on so I'm on bless hit ok and it should take it down to where it's at in the um, dot .dat file go ahead and highlight it and hit control V hit save hit save it's done so now we're good to go so we're going to have our parameter the SFO reassigned, the SFV reassigned, and the dot dat reassigned. So now go to your folder right here and make sure this is like that too. That's optional. You really don't have to do that. But just make sure you have everything organized, clean to go. Go ahead, open this up, and start replacing files. Move and replace. PS3 game. User directory. License like that. Replace that. Drag your param in there. Replace that. Now the game is good to go. And I'll have a tutorial in the description below teaching you guys how to put this onto your PS3 if you guys do not know how to do that. So check the description guys and I'm happy I can help you out with this tutorial. Go ahead, download your new mods, whatever you want. Region free, unlimited region change, do what you want guys. Hope this video helped you guys. If it did, please leave a like on my video. Go ahead and subscribe for more videos. And let's hit that like button. Zach Super Lobbies, I'm out. Peace.